Hello friends. Welcome to my new design pattern tutorial series video. Today, I will teach you, how to implement strategy design pattern in Java. Friends. Strategy design pattern is a behavioral design pattern. It defines a family of algorithms, encapsulates each one, and makes them interchangeable. It dynamically picks an algorithm based on client strategy. Also, it lets the algorithm vary independently from client that use it. Let's see tutorial overview through a class diagram. Friends. Here I take use case of football teams. Let's say we have two teams Germany and Argentina. Therefore, here team is a super class to team Argentina and team Germany. Also in football each team has a strategy, which they can change frequently. Here we will create two strategies such as, attack and defense. Team strategy is an interface having a play method. It has two concrete implementations such as, attack strategy and defense strategy. Here, both team strategies are like algorithms and they are interchangeable for a team. That is, a team can play in attacking position at one time and defensive position other time. Therefore, in order to implement this dynamic behavior, team class has a team strategy instance variable. Once the test class decides a strategy for a team, it will associate strategy to team. On calling play game method of team, it will directly call play method of concrete team strategy through team strategy instance variable. Let's see it through a demonstration. In design pattern tutorial Java project, let's create a Java interface. Provide a name to it as team strategy. Keep it in a package as com. Hubberspot. Design pattern. Behavioral. Strategy. Click finish. It creates an interface by name, team strategy. Let's provide it a method signature as public void play, taking in an string value. This play method takes in a name of team. After creating interface, let's move ahead and create a concrete team strategy subclass. Provide a class name as attack strategy. Keep it in same package and click finish. Make this attack strategy class implements team strategy interface. It prompts us to implement abstract play method of team strategy interface. This play method takes in a team name as parameter to it. I will just sys out. Team name. Will play in attacking mode. Let's move ahead and create another concrete team strategy subclass. Provide a class name as defense strategy. Keep it in same package and click finish. Make this defense strategy class implements team strategy interface. It prompts us to implement abstract play method of team strategy interface. This play method takes in a team name as parameter to it. I will just sys out. Team name. Will play in defensive mode. These two strategies are dynamic in a football match, and are interchangeable based on team strategy. Thus, strategy design pattern helps us in changing team strategies dynamically at runtime. Let's move ahead and create another Java class. Provide a class name as, team. Keep it in same package and click finish. As discussed in previous slide, we provide this team class two instance variables such as string team name and team strategy type. 
Team strategy type will act as a, has a relationship, that is team class has a team strategy. Also, provide getters and setters of it. Moving ahead. We will provide this team class an abstract method by name, team info. Make team class as abstract and allow its concrete classes to implement team info method. Finally, we also provide a method by name, play game. This method will have code which takes team strategy super type and call its play method by passing team name to it. Thus, it provides power to concrete team class to change strategy dynamically at runtime. We will see it later how. Let's move ahead and create a concrete team subclass. Provide a class name as Team Germany. Keep it in same package and click finish. Make this Team Germany class extends team class. It prompts us to implement abstract team info method of team class. To this method, I will just sys out German football team. Moving ahead. Perform same steps with Team Argentina class as demonstrated. Moving ahead, let's create a Java main class which will demonstrate actual working of strategy design pattern. Provide a name to it as, strategy pattern test. In the main method, first let's instantiate both concrete teams, Germany and Argentina, as demonstrated. In order for these teams to choose different strategies at runtime, let's instantiate both the strategies such as attack strategy and defense strategy, as demonstrated. So now football match starts and Germany starts game with defensive mode. Argentina starts game with attacking mode. Therefore, set team strategy for team Germany as defend and Set team strategy for Team Argentina as, attack as demonstrated. Also, set team names to respective names. Now, 
we start game and let team play game. Call team info and play game method for both teams. Call info method is just for displaying team information. But, play game will print strategies with which teams are playing. Let's run the program. It prints, at start. German football team. Will play in defensive mode. And. Argentina football team. Will play in attacking mode. Now let's say after half time both teams want to change their strategy. Germany wants to play in attacking mode and Argentina wants to play in defensive mode. Thus, we call again set strategy method on both teams with different strategy, as demonstrated. And copy paste above code to start playing game after half time. Let's run this program once again. It prints. After half time. German football team. Will play in attacking mode. Argentina football team. Will play in defensive mode. Thus, you can see how easily we can change strategy of a team dynamically at runtime. This interchangeable of algorithms dynamically is nothing but strategy design pattern. This is how strategy design pattern works in Java. So friends, go through this video two to three times so that, how to implement strategy design pattern in Java, concept gets more clear to you. Hope you like this video. Please give one minute to like, share, comment or subscribe my channel, or you can visit my website at www.hubberspot.com.